Hello, we are here for one more lesson of this AutoCAD 2016 training course and the topic for today will be Point Cloud. Um, so we have the possibility to make uh, import of Point Cloud files. This, this has some special uh, features, but uh, basically um, we can uh, import these special files which normally are obtained from 3D scanner, um, it doesn't matter the, the process, but uh, from small parts or big things you can create this, uh, this cloud of points. Um, AutoCAD cannot import this cloud of points directly, so uh, there is an application uh, inside the insert and then you have this special application inside AutoCAD that is called Autodesk Recap and this Autodesk Recap can uh, open uh, the point cloud from a scanner and can create a special format that AutoCAD can recognize and import inside the system. If you click here uh, it will open this application. I have it already open because it takes a little time in my computer. So this is uh, the look of this application when you click here. And uh, I have um, one example that comes with AutoCAD already open. So this is a point cloud. As you can see, a lot of points. And you can make some things here. Uh, for example, uh, we can see what was uh, uh, done to create this point cloud. We can measure distances, for example, between points. You, you need to, to, to choose the correct points. I'm just using randomly. Um, and we can make a couple of, a couple of things like uh, putting more points or less points. Okay, uh, I'll leave this as a standard option even because um, I, I, I have already a file created from this, uh, this system. So the idea is coming into uh, AutoCAD, make the import of this point cloud doing here, the attach. And I have an Autodesk recap, whatever. So open. It may take a little because my computer is not so fast and this is uh, quite heavy. Uh, and the idea, okay, I can import this. Okay. And uh, when you import, because this kind of file uh, takes. Uh, insertion point, okay, scale factor, rotation angle, and okay. Um, as I was saying, this kind of file takes a lot of resources from your system. So uh, the idea now that you have this is to create entities uh, clicking in points and creating your geometry, okay. Uh, even so, uh, we can uh, take care a little about uh, this information and you can, for example, reduce uh, the size and the density of points that you've imported. You can do that on in Recap or you can do this here directly in, 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 in AutoCAD. Um, we have, um, I'll try to show you because my computer is not so fast with this uh, heavy information. Uh, we have uh, a variable that is called point, sorry, the point uh, cloud uh, load. And this variable uh, asks you for a value. And if you reduce this value, I have 10. Imagine that I will say uh, 5. So uh, it reduces probably in this particular case to too much, but it will reduce the density of points so it will take a little less effort for your machine to uh, deal with this kind of information. Anyway, the idea here is to explain you that it's possible to deal with this information and uh, 
to uh, show you one or two tools on how you can deal with this.